Welcome back to another episode of Cobra Kai Companion. We're doing another live stream. Joining us on YouTube today, streaming live, is Aiden Minx and Khalil Everidge. Hey, guys. Good. Hello, what up? Hey, Hello. how's summer been? I'm Brianna. Well, I guess... I'm here, too. Yes, yes, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking at the screen. I just see those two. <laughs> I, it's been, I guess it's been a while since it we've done been. this. It has been. It has been. Yeah. Um, well, well, Brianna, how are you? I'm wonderful. <laughs> All right. All right. I'm glad to hear. Um, today uh, is also the day after Aiden's uh, 20th birthday. So happy birthday, Aiden. Thank you. Yes. Oh, happy right. birthday. So, yeah, yeah, we, yeah. We didn't celebrate yesterday, so we're celebrating today instead. You got all the balloons and stuff behind me. I don't know if you can see them, but. Oh, really, yeah. Yeah, they're flying like all it. over the place. I like it. Oh. One went right by your face when I was introducing <laughs> you. Screen, yeah. just... <laughs> uh, Khalil, what you been up to, sir? Nothing much, chilling. Yeah, yeah. I I, I, I see your uh, um for the past like two weeks I've been building a studio in my crib. Yeah, uh, and you're uh, you know representing one of your friends, the t-shirt there. You say what? You're representing your friend there wearing one of the t-shirts. Oh yeah, this is one of my friends' his clothing line, big homie sensei. This is an older shirt, but okay. This is your your hat. What is that? A Tennessee Titan hat? Yeah. Titan oh okay. Hat. Is that your team? No. <laughs> No, so no, you blue, just, I just like the hat. I like the colors. Okay. The colors? I, I got like, like three socks too. hats, though. Yeah, yeah. What are your teams, by the way? White Sox. Okay. Bears, Bulls. I don't, oh, of course. I don't really watch, I don't really watch um, hockey. Football. Oh, hockey. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm with you. I'm, I'm with you on the Bears and the Bulls. Um, I'm a Cardinals fan, though. So, because I'm, <laughs> I'm in... <laughs> I'm in Southern I'm Illinois, Cardinals. Khalil. I'm sorry. I'm closer to St. Louis than I am Chicago, but why are you not a uh, Rams fan? Or what are y'all now? Not y'all anymore. Know. They abandoned have... us. That's tough. Yeah, <laughs> I was. Now I hate them. Aiden, what about you? Are you into any sports? Uh, I, did, I did football in high school, and then they changed coaches, and like he wasn't very nice. So yeah, uh, no, but uh, like. I don't, know. I don't really, I don't really watch sports. My my mom liked hockey. She liked going to Ducks games, so we would go to those every once in a while. But, Anaheim Ducks. Uh, yeah, Anaheim Ducks. Like yeah, okay, we okay. Once a couple of those, but like yeah. Other than that, not really a sports person. But yeah. Yeah, that's all right. But I see you, you've been out and about doing things too. So um, sounds like you guys are kind of enjoying some some time off there. Um, all right. So just to address the people that are tuning in. Uh, this this is a this or that. So it's kind of like a would you rather. So I'm going to give Aiden and Khalil a pairing. They're going to choose which one and why, and we're going to play along as well. Um, all right, so we'll just go alphabetical order. Aiden, starting with you. Um, after Aiden, I'll jump in, then Khalil, then Brianna. How about that? Okay. All right. Okay, so let's see here. We got one uh, from Joseph L. Boat training or tree training for balance? So so um, it's the Karate Kid with Daniel on, on the boat with Miyagi or the tree training uh, in the forest with Robbie and Daniel? Oh, I think I gotta go with uh, tree. <laughs> I gotta go All with tree. Right. So Khalil Tree, uh, Aiden, you said, you said boat? Yeah, boat like to go fishing, like you know, while you're taking a break or whatever, you know. <laughs> okay, okay, I like that, Khalil. Why uh, the tree for you? It's like the, the I feel like the forest atmosphere and the the, the and realizing the balance and all that on the in, in the forest. Yeah, I like that. Okay, yeah, let's see. with it. All right, no. <laughs> um, you know what? I I I think I'm gonna agree with Khalil on this. I'm gonna go with the tree, um, because less likely to get wet uh, if I lose balance. Uh, Brianna, what about you? I feel like I know your answer. I have to go with tree because I can't swim. Oh, okay. Not, not, I did. That's not where Nor- I thought you'd go. Yeah, yeah. Normally, <laughs> I mean, if you're just asking me which is my favorite to watch, oh, yeah, the boat. But as far as me personally doing it um, in the boat, I would die. So, yeah, I got to do the tree. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, Aiden, um, from the same person, Joseph L. asked uh, crane kick or handstand kick? Ugh. I mean, I'm able to do a crane kick, so those. But <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, crane kicks aren't that difficult. <laughs> okay, all right. <laughs> There's a Miyagi Do student. Um, okay, uh, let's see. Yeah, you know what? I just for what Khalil said, it's easier to perform um, crane kick. So Khalil, is that what you're going with too? 
Uh, I don't really like the pain that it causes in the front foot of a, <laughs> of a crane kick, but yeah, I think I still go with it. Okay. Yeah. Rihanna, what about you? Um, old school. Daniel at his finest. Got to do the crane. You know, we got to ask uh, Hito uh, if if it was his. Dec- who came up with a handstand kick? Do we do we discuss that with like um, who did different but same? Oh, that was the big three, didn't they? They wrote that one. Someone said something about they just had to. They were thinking about like pitching something that could top. That, that, that would be like something that Daniel had never learned, but I can't remember who it was that said it. Yeah. Okay. All right. Here's uh this is a very fitting one. Um, Matt S or Matty S beep up or rock steady. Aiden beep up or rock steady. Uh, it's, I get them confused, but the one with the horn. That, that's rock steady. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Do you guys even know which is which for you? I don't, I don't know, know if that was ever established. I don't know. I personally don't oh, yeah, know. He went rock steady and bebop. Well, yeah, he went rock steady and bebop. He pointed to me first, so I, I guess I'm rock steady. <laughs> okay. Khalil, you don't know uh, who they are? You didn't watch... Um, I did. That. I did. I just didn't, I just didn't understand it. Still didn't know. Okay, so yeah, uh, bebop would be the warthog, and the rhinoceros is uh, rock steady. <laughs> Like, at so, first I was hearing it, I didn't know what they were, and then they are like, it's these guys, and I just saw the pictures, and I was like, oh, yeah, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and they're like, you yeah. knew that, but not the name. Oh, from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the, uh, <laughs> the rhinoceros and the... Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. I think I'm the rhinoceros. Yeah, they were the, like, the, like, the, the punk I, guys, they, but they're yeah, all... Yeah, the family, yeah. You guys are fighting over the rhinoceros, it yeah. sounds yeah. like. <laughs> I, think I, I think I give off more rhinoceros vibes than Aiden does. Can you, I, you think... <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> all right. I mean, uh, isn't Bebop the one with the like the Kanye glasses, right? He's got like, um, what are they called? I guess, I guess I'm more the vibing kind, so I, I'll be, I'll be, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, let's see. For oh, well, I guess I said Bebop. Uh, Brianna, what about you? Um, I like Rocksteady better. Really? Okay. Yeah. Um, I have to say something. Christy and and Carrie both pointed it out in the chat. Yes, guys, you are hearing a smoke detector with a dying battery. <laughs> you are not. That, yeah. yeah, you are. You are not. Uh, you're, not you're not hallucinating, and there's nothing wrong with the stream. It's actually there. There's no soundboard either. Yeah, we just I can't apologize. do anything about it. <laughs> no, I apologize. I turned my mic down a little bit. No, no, no. We don't need that. Uh, okay, so the next one here, uh, Joseph L. also asked again: DC or Marvel? Aiden, DC or Marvel? Marvel. I like, yeah, dark, I like DC. I've always just been a fan of like Batman and Joker. Like literally, like as I was being birthed, my brother ran through. Like <laughs> mm. you're gonna be, you're gonna be uh, Robin, and I'm gonna be Batman. And my mom's like, get out. <laughs> 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 so yeah, it's just since I literally since the day I was born, just Batman and Robin. Yeah. So, okay. Yeah. That's it for me. <laughs> Kalu, I'm going to have you uh, go uh, go next. I need to run and grab my plug. My, my computer's low. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh so he's about to Marvel. Yep. Yeah. Definitely 100% going with Marvel. Marvel just has more superstars. Uh, you got <laughs> Spider-Man. You got the Hulk. You got Thor. Then you even get to the, the Captain America. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Iron Man. It's, just so, it's, it's too many stars. Too many stars on, on Marvel, so I have to go on Marvel. Okay. Um, <laughs> let's see. While Peter's plugging himself in, I have to say I've never watched an entire Marvel movie all the way through as far as what we know is the MCU. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> I've, I've How never... many recent Marvel movies are just hits? Yeah, I've, I've seen like half of Winter Soldier, I think. And that's, that's it. Um, my probably my favorite uh, but um but i have seen all of the real spider-man toby Maguire movies there. so um i would have to go with marvel just because i love toby Maguire. and also jessica alba was the original invisible woman and she kicks ass so there you go i agree with that i like me some jessica cool. alba um Let's see here. Uh, I, I'm going to go with DC because I'm a big fan of Superman, even though I was named after Peter Parker. <laughs> so fun fact about me there. 
Um, now, I don't know if you guys know this, but uh, Rose Bianco, who played Yaya, she was in a cut scene from Black Panther. So for the for the Marvel fans there. Really? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. That's awesome. Mm hmm. Um, OK, so the next one we got is uh, cement mixer or pitching machine. Wait, wait, wait. Cement mixer, pitching machine versus house chores. So I guess it's uh, Cobra Kai versus Miyagi-Do training. I think, yeah, Cobra Kai training. It's a lot more badass. <laughs> you guys uh, both I'm, got to be in the cement mixer. I'm, Spiritual. Look about it. I don't know. <laughs> I'm personally going with Miyagi-Do. Uh, they be able to do push-ups and, and stuff like that. Knuckle push-ups and, you know. <laughs> What's the thing when you go down and jump up and then? Oh, yeah. Or, burpees. They be doing burpees. burpees. Yeah. Oh, burpees, yeah. You know, there was the one scene we just had to do, like, burpees the whole time. And, it, like, it was like it was just like, all right, and, all right, we got to do it again. So, like, it was like we were getting a real workout. It was <laughs> like the whole so time. Go with the you know, Yagi-Do training. <laughs> so quitting are, football are you... practice did you no good whatsoever. You still had to do all the nonsense anyway. Oh, oh yeah, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> It's like, Khalil, are you uh, a little, little fragile? A little fragile. Just a, tad just, fragile. Just a little, just little fragile. <laughs> just a tad fragile. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, the, the next one, we got Rhea or Shitlip. So this, uh, these are the nicknames for Miguel and Hawk. <laughs> Shitlip. <laughs> you, you like Shitlip? Shitlip's funny. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It is a little bit funnier, right? I mean... I'm gonna be honest with you. When I first heard Rhea, I go, I don't know if that's much of a, you know, a diss or, you know. <laughs> when I first read the script, I didn't like read what was ha- like because like before I was auditioning for Bo, and like when I was reading the script, I didn't like like really read through like the in betweens, just like the lines. So I'm like, who the hell names their kid Rhea? This doesn't make sense. <laughs> and then like I start and I went back and read it. And I'm like, oh, it's a joke about diarrhea. Now it makes sense. Right. Like, yeah. <laughs> I don't know if they should have shortened it. It should have just been diarrhea. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I get it, though. Like, Rhea, I don't know. Yeah, that they're the only like ones that thing. understand where it came from, though. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Otherwise, yeah. Rhea is an actual name. Right. So, <laughs> yeah. I was like, Rhea, all right. <laughs> so, I don't know. I, yeah, I'm, I'm going to agree with the, the two two of them shit lip. What about you, Brianna? Um, man, I don't know. That's so mean. <laughs> I I hate Kyler on general principle, and I love Eli, so I don't know. I have to go with Rhea, I guess, because it's kind of more dumb than mean. Okay, all right. I I like the answer to that. All right, here's a good one. Uh, this one's from John A. Boneside tree or drought resistant cactus? So, Russo Otto or Tom Cole? Bonsai's look cool. But like cactuses are like you, you you just like put a drop of water on them and you don't have to like touch them like ever and they just sit in your room so probably a cactus. Do you have one? No. Like, well, actually, yeah, we have, yeah we have succulents, but not not a cactus. But yeah. <laughs> is that a uh, is that a cactus adjacent? What was a succulent? Succulents just like like the type of plant in general where it's just like barely needs any water and just oh. it just grows and looks all pretty. So <laughs> look at this. You're a botanist too. Yeah. Love the love the droughts. <laughs> okay, yeah, I'm gonna go old school and go with bonsai tree. Uh, what about you, Khalil? Uh, personally, I don't think neither because I will let them die. <laughs> but well, that's the thing. Cactus is, is harder to kill, so. But I don't want to see a cactus in my house either. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm definitely gonna go with bonsai tree. That's okay. right, because you're fragile. Cactus is that's gonna poke your finger, and you yeah. don't want that. I don't want that. I want to be able to touch my 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 plant son. Okay, I got you. What about you, Brianna? Um, uh, like Khalil, I would murder both in under thirty seconds flat. Um, but bonsai are prettier, and I have entirely too many cats in this house to have cactuses. Mm. So, gotta go with bonsai. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can understand that. Uh, John A has another one: torched Pontiac Firebird or booze-soaked abandoned Challenger. Ooh, so I mean, is it after all the upgrades? I, yeah, because um, I'm assuming that the, he's thinking about the the end of season two, where Johnny, you know, yeah, the, the, the two bottle. ways the two ways Johnny lost his car. One was Louis setting the 
Firebird <laughs> on fire, and then the other was him abandoning the Challenger. So. That oh. Challenger hard. Yeah. That I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. I got a picture about a Challenger, and I'm standing like this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Have we didn't we need seen to see that, that picture. I don't Sorry, think we have. Like, I kind of want one of those. <laughs> We we uh if it was if that picture was taken during season two, do you still have it? Probably somewhere in my photos. Okay. Um all right. Uh so you Cleo, you said Challenger. Aiden, what did you pick? Did you pick Challenger, one? yeah. I kinda Challenger I, too. Yeah, the first car I wanted was like an SRT Challenger. Like I, I yeah, I, I was looking at them. They were nice. And when I got to set, I was even like, Oh, Challenger and like <laughs> sent a picture of yeah, Do you have a car now? No, no, I don't even drive. T- legal. Tell your mom you want a Challenger. <laughs> yeah, there you go. I actually just crashed my sister's car. Oh no! Oh gosh! What? Like what happened? <laughs> <laughs> or you don't want you no legal stuff right now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we... I admit to crashing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we, we don't have to bring up why or how. Uh, for me, I'm gonna go with Challenger because you can still. You know, wash off all the booze silkiness, I guess. Uh, the Pontiac Firebird, that was in bad shape. What about you, Brianna? Um, I'm going to go with the Firebird only because it led to the first almost reconciliation between him and Daniel. Okay. No flaming Firebird, no different but same. So. Yeah, okay, I get that. Um, all right. Next one's from Joey Z. Now, this one's in reference to the Credit Kid Part 2, so I'm not sure if either of you have seen it or when's the last time you saw it. Uh, broken Ice or Broken Neck? Wait, what was it? Oh, was it Broken Neck, Miguel? No, no. This It is, was, uh, but it wasn't. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Actually, you're... Yeah, right, right. Um, no, no, this this is all uh, in reference to Part 2. Things okay. that, yeah, were said. Like so would little- you rather... Break what? ice or have your neck broken, I guess. <laughs> it was chosen off for Daniel, those those choices. Broken yeah. ice or broken neck. Uh, ice. Yeah. Because yeah. then if you bruise it, it's already on ice. And it's 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 already getting fixed. So All got- right. <laughs> I like that. I feel like we, we asked this to Gianni. I think he said the same thing. Oh, he did? <laughs> I think so. Damn it. <sighs> that that sounds right. <laughs> um, let's see. I'm going to go with broken ice. Um because we didn't get that in season two, and uh, I, broken neck sounds like par, you know, being paralyzed. That that doesn't sound fun at all. Uh, Cleo, what about you? Um, Aiden's pretty intelligent, so I'm gonna go with his answer. <laughs> Yanni's Gian, even more intelligent, so both of them go hey, ahead. Fair answer. enough. <laughs> All right. What about you, Brianna? Um, I'm going to have to go with Broken Ice just because um, Miguel is proving that Broken Neck is really not fun. Yeah. Uh, well, I mean, he we see in the teaser he wakes up from it. So, Yep. Yeah. You know. Yep. But I mean, how much would the how much would the rest of the movie sucked if Daniel broke his neck halfway through it? Uh, that, that is true. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. All right. So this one is in reference to season one. Uh, where we see Brux, uh, Rick G says skinny dips or bong rips. Would you rather skinny dip or rip bongs? <laughs> What's a rip bongs? Um, b- b- like just taking a really big toke out, out of, off a of bong. Bong hits. Bong rips is basically bong hits. Bong hit before the skinny dip. Okay, so both. <laughs> yeah, I, I, wait, so I'm definitely doing both. <laughs> <laughs> we can and we can jump in together. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta keep the socks on. All right. Gotta keep the okay. Socks. Everything the sock. but socks. And my hat. Gotta keep my socks and my hat on. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> huh. Yeah. You know what? Um, I don't. I don't know about joining you guys, but I'll. You know, bong bong rips over skinny dips for sure. Brianna? Skinny dips are very refreshing. I haven't done it in a long time. But the universe is. would rather Thank see sure. me stoned than naked, so go in with bong rips. <laughs> All right. The two old people yeah. go with the bong rips. <laughs> Cowards. All right. Cowards, for real. Oh, <laughs> I'm okay well, with our that. Our heyday is long over. That's why. It's yeah. time for you guys to rise and, and you know take on the I'm mantle of rebellion. 
I'm gonna be sixty doing. <laughs> I thought that too when I was twenty, and now I'm almost yeah. fifty, and it's like, what the hell was I thinking? That's I right. agree. Se- like Seventeen years ago, still having OnlyFans. Like, all right, <laughs> <laughs> five bucks. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, next one from Sarah L. Badass versus balance. Would you rather badass versus balance? So badass, would you rather be badass or would you rather be someone with balance? Mm. Badass, like yeah, what B- balance? <laughs> badass, like no one's gonna Whatever. be like, oh my god, it's about being balanced. Okay, this balance, I want it. Like no. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, definitely going badass. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I feel like, uh, I feel you know, Chris like has that line. You know, answer, who's badass now? Answers. I'm sorry. Who's badass now? Right, that's Chris's answer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's badass now? <laughs> All, right. All right, okay. Yeah. Um, Aiden, who's badass now, Aiden? <laughs> <laughs> Physics book to the face. Boom. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go with badass as well. Uh, Brianna? I'm going to 100% vote for Chris and say a badass with balance. Okay. okay. Because All right. like he that. gets that awesome kick to the back end and gets to deliver a physics book to the face. Who else gets to do that? That's real. Yeah. Yep. I, I think you're bringing up bad memories for Aiden here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fine. It's just... <laughs> Was that you or your stun double that I hit in the face? I think I, it's probably I hit somebody for real with the book by accident. Oh, oh with the yeah. Yeah. So, Suddenly so, everything's so blurry. Yeah, I wanted. Yeah, I wanted to do all my own stunts, but like they didn't. They didn't, they didn't want me getting hurt. Yeah. Well, obviously, does. if if <laughs> if um if Mitch in that moment got hit in the face with a physics book for real, it may have been a good thing that it was the stunt man. No, 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 no. Then you got, then you got like raw, real acting. It's like, oh, dang, it really happened. It's great. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and no. you're really it, unconscious on the hallway floor. Yeah. <laughs> it, it would, Mark on your face it, and everything. It would have been great for like a resume, right? I got hit with a book. Like that was me. Just knocked out. It's great. Got a glass jaw now. <laughs> yeah. uh, all right. The next one uh, is from one of our moderators, Kaz. Cruel Summer or You're the Best Around? So the original songs. Yeah, you're the best around. Like, uh, I, I was playing that song a lot when I found out I got the part. Oh, really? <laughs> like I just okay. got. So I just like I just like heard. It. I was just like playing it. Like I had played it in the trailer as soon as I put my. No, no, no. It, when I got when I got in the trailer and it was the um, the All Valley. No, no, not All Valley. The one where we were uh, interrupting their little show at the car place where oh. they were break the ice and instead Cobra Kai. Uh, uh, Valley Fest. Yeah, Valley that, Fest. That, that's what it was like when we. Um, that, that was when I first saw, like, the Cobra Kai gi and everything, and it had, like, the really cool, like, it was the black one, like, cut off. And, like, I saw it, and I just freaked out. I put it on, and I put on the song, and my mom took pictures. It was a good time, great time. Yeah. Uh, we're going to need to see, see some of those pictures. I, I don't know if I've seen any other than just the screenshots from Valley Fest, so. I think it was uh, just uh, on my Instagram. Oh, well, yeah, we'll definitely have to uh, find those. Uh, Cleo, what about you? you? You like Cruel Summer, or uh, you're the best around? I like. What's the new one? Uh, well, there was the the, the remake of Cruel Summer on uh, season two. Cruel Summer, that's that hard. Do you like yeah, the, the? Okay, okay, I do remember seeing that one. That's doing hard. Yeah. Uh, do you like the new version or the older version? The new. I like everything new. It's a new version. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that car. Um, the artist is Kari Kimmel. It's really good too. Uh, I I'm gonna go with Cruel Summer over You're the Best Around. Uh, I'll leave it at that because I've said some controversial stuff about you're the best around. Uh, Brianna, what about you? You're a piece of crap, and the correct answer is you're the best. That's always the answer. Always, always, always. What's wrong with Cruel Summer? There's nothing wrong with Cruel Summer. There's That's nothing a great wrong song with too. Cruel Summer, but whatever you said that you caught crap for about uh, you're the best, you deserved it. <laughs> okay. Uh, but also, to be fair, between the two songs, Cruel Summer is something I would have my top down bump into. You're the best around, you know. That's that's something you you dance around oh, in your own that. bedroom. I like the hat. I had my little beanie on. <laughs> it was that was a cold day. 
Was it, 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 it made like photos code there... on TV, but it, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. I said, I said it may not look cold on TV, but it was, it was, it was, it was really cold. <laughs> Our friend Josh was an extra in that scene, and he like has his winter coat on in the Fact. audience. So we were so we were sleeveless. We were sleeveless out there. Isn't yeah, I, um isn't Paul wearing shorts? I feel Paul might have been wearing. I mean, there there were probably people in shorts too. So I believe it. Um, well, my husband get, wears yeah. shorts in January in Illinois. So. No, there's people like that though. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm straight jogging pants all season. Uh, Khalil, that photo was that uh, is that on your phone or do you have that posted somewhere? No, nah, it was just on my phone. Uh, it was just on my phone. Oh, okay. See, I, I have seen Aiden's chat. before it's too, chat chat. somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Uh, next one we got. Okay, that one was already asked. Okay, uh, this one there's no context, but from uh, Katarina B, Aisha, or Tori. Both cobras. Like, fight them or be friends with them? Like, I'm not sure. I guess however you take it, and you know that's how you'll answer. I mean, I lost against Tori, so I'm gonna try again. Yeah, All right. Against yeah. Let's see how I do with that. Yeah. Okay. Okay, I like that. Um, uh, Cleo, what about you? I'll have you go you after it. Who, who, who would I want to fight? Sure. Uh, yeah, I think however you want to take it, to be honest. Aisha or Tori? Um, I think I want both. They're both covered guys, so I want both. <laughs> Bring them both, okay. Just wants to purge the whole the whole class. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going both. Okay, um, for me, I, I'm going to go with, um, I'm going to go with Tori. I, I just want to see more backstory. That's mm -hmm. how I'm going to approach it. I want to see more of Tori uh, than I do. Uh, Aisha, I felt I, I felt like we got um, a good enough background of her from season one. Uh, we, we got her in season two. Tori was the new girl. We can use more story on her. Uh, what about you, Brianna? I adore them both. They are both just phenomenally badass. But no battery. <laughs> no, no kidding. <laughs> Aisha was there Alexa? first. Aisha is my queen. So Aisha. Uh, the first lady of Cobra Kai is what yes, I called her. Absolutely. Yeah. All right. So here's a fun one. Uh, this one comes from Kaz. Uh, have a date at golf and stuff or the 80s roller skating rink, Aiden? I fall on my ass a lot. In, yeah. Uh, so, <laughs> yeah, pro probably just golf and stuff. You know, get to try out everything. If I suck at one thing, just move to the next. Yeah. Well, <laughs> one could argue you could fall on your ass at golf and stuff. Shit. Fine. We all did. Okay, we were supposed to meet up at golf and stuff. Do you remember that? What was that? We were supposed to meet up at golf and stuff back in December. Oh damn! <laughs> yeah. But I got, I got caught up in that uh, bad LA traffic, and so I had to cancel with you guys because yeah. we were gonna try to um, get like a small uh, meet up, you know, with like Gianni and stuff. You know, some of you, some of you guys yeah. over in Cali. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so golf and stuff. Uh, Cleo, what about you? Um, definitely rolling skating. Okay. I used, to, I used to roller skate when I was younger. Do you so still have it? Do you you got no. tricks? Do you do tricks? No, no, no. no backwards. Nah, I'm just I'm just you know smooth with it. You know I know how to stay on beat when it, when it, when the beat. Okay. Can. Okay. You know we need some of those videos. Uh, now I I don't know if he if this was just a set or did he actually really skate. But Brett Ernst, who plays uh, Cousin Louie, uh, he, he has a set, you can look it up on YouTube, where he talks about uh, roller skating, how there's always like that one guy who knows more tricks than you. And yeah. uh, it's really, really funny. You guys got to check it out. Um, for me, I would probably, you know, I'm going to go with the 80s roller skating rink because I can get down with all the music playing for 80s night. Uh, the golf and stuff, I, I feel you can go anytime. Um, and yeah, I, I guess that's it. What about you, Brianna? As the only person on this call old enough to have actually skated in a skate rink in the 80s, <laughs> golf and stuff. Because <laughs> I was also clumsy in the 80s, and I, like Aiden, fell on my ass every time. Uh, I, I feel like I'm, I could have been at the roller skiings in 89. Oh, what? At, at two? 
six. I was six years old. <laughs> okay, you know, maybe not. You know, you're probably right. I was a teenager. Yeah, my earliest memory of a skating rink was like second grade. How old <sighs> is that? Is that ten? No, seven. What, seven? seven. Okay, see, so it would have been like ninety, ninety one. So, okay, you're right. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'll try to help you out. You didn't have to go there, though. Um, all right, Aiden, uh, boba tea or nachos? Oh, I love boba. Yeah? Oh, no kidding. What's your flavor? Uh, I kind of, I don't know. I kind of like, um, like Thai tea, milk tea, um, yes. taro. I really like taro, um, but as a slushy. Yeah, taro slushy with boba. Don't, that one's, there's a fly. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. So yeah, the taro tea with boba. I like it. This, this fly is making an appearance everywhere. Oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> I think someone might screen capture you and add Miyagi or Daniel with the chopsticks now. Uh, um, <laughs> chopsticks. Yeah. Uh, do you ever do like lychee jelly, or is it always just boba for you? Uh yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. I tried the jellies. I also did the popper ones, where like it goes around. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All sweet, like. Uh, popping boba, yeah, that's a little a little weird the texture, but it's good flavor. Yeah, like, it's like, yeah, it's like it's like a like a layer of skin, and it's like you, you chew it. Yeah, I'm not a fan of boba like, tea. Yeah, you you're not helping anybody out here, Aiden. Uh, but if we it's ever like, hook up again, we'll definitely get covered juice if yeah. you guys are interested. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's pretty good. Uh, so clear, you're gonna go with nachos. You say what? You're gonna go with nachos. Hundred percent nachos. Hundred percent. Okay. And, um, I, and I and I hook my nachos up. Oh well, yeah, how so? Yeah, jalapenos. You have, no, you ever had jerk chicken taco, jerk chicken taco nachos? I mean, yeah, uh-huh. nachos. Dragon. Yeah. Nachos. <laughs> I've had jerk pulled, I've had pulled pork nachos, but I've not had jerk chicken. And I had well, buffalo chicken in decent. Atlanta. Oh, there's a you bar. What? In, there's a bar in Atlanta. When you guys go back down for season four, they serve buffalo chicken nachos. You've got to get them. They're amazing. Is that the pub we went to? Yes. Oh. Oh, they got Don't blue cheese the on them. Oh, they're so good. Okay. Uh, all right. Let me see. I'm going to go with Boba. Um, I have that like once every week at least. Uh, I'm a fan of the, the brown sugar Boba. Uh, all right, next one. Okay, you guys are both too young for this, but I'll ask you anyway. Uh, Aiden, <laughs> Coors Banquet or Martini? Uh, I'm told Banquet is <laughs> good. Uh. <laughs> Disclaimer, we do not encourage underage drinking on this show. <laughs> so the wrong to either, Aiden? <laughs> 20 and one day. I'm 21, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you're almost there. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what about you, Khalil? Mm, either for real, but okay. Yeah, um, That's okay. Martini, probably. Probably more of a martini. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, for me, I would probably go Coors Banquet over Martini. I guess it really depends on the Martini, but the way Daniel has it, probably not. Um, is what's Banquet? Uh, uh, Coors Banquet. It's Johnny's just, beer. Yeah, it's, John, it's a beer that Johnny drinks. Like, <laughs> yeah. yeah beer, beer, beer tastes like piss. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you could get you could get ones that are flavored and you know have things that like I had a beer last night with some mango, you know. So it tastes like good. mango flavored piss. I happen to agree with <laughs> Leo. Beer is nasty. <laughs> that sounds exotic. Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, what about you, Brianna? Oh, you said you agree with Khalil. Yeah, beer is nasty, and I lived on vodka in high school. We do not endorse underage drinking on this show. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, here's another one. Aiden, Game of Thrones or Harry Potter? Uh, I didn't watch either. <laughs> I, like, oh, no I, tried, I tried to watch uh, Game of Thrones, like, a little bit. Like I, like, I did like it. I did want to get into it. And then, like... I was watching it with my brother, and we got like through the first like two or three episodes together. And he's like, "All right, don't watch any more without me." And like, he never sat down with me again. So I'm like, I like we just like left it, never got back to it. So like, I I got to the part right where the Stark guy got his head chopped off. So oh, that's yeah. I think that's, that's like end of season one. Yeah, like, little season. I think yeah. That's pretty good. And, but Harry Potter, I like watched like the first one or two movies. Uh, that was fun. Yeah, let's see. Yeah. Game of Thrones, yeah, sorry. I like medieval, yeah, hardcore. 
do you guys think that sometimes Mary could kind of look like uh, Amelia Clark? Oh, yeah. <laughs> they both have. Clark play. Uh, she plays Daenerys Targaryen. Oh. Because yeah. Amelia Clark originally has brown hair like wow. Mary does, and they both have the blue eyes. Like, I don't know. I, I, I kind of saw that, but people were calling me crazy. Yeah, <laughs> crazy. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, hi, like... AJ. AJ's in the chat. AJ, my boy. Gone. Yeah. AJ at the uh, Owens in there. Did we see anybody else? Uh, not yet. AJ and Owen right. are the only two I've seen so far. Uh, Khalil, what about you? Uh, Game of Thrones or Harry Potter? Uh, I saw one Harry Potter when I was younger, like when I was like maybe eight or something. Really? It didn't even appeal to you, all the magic and stuff? It's not interesting. It's uh, well, what, uh, which one but did you see? The first one. The first one? And you didn't like it, huh? And the second one, nah. Okay. Hmm. Well, Game uh, of Thrones. Wow. Game of Thrones. That's probably the best show ever created. So definitely going with Game of Thrones. Yeah, uh, next to Cobra Kai. Second best. Second best. Yeah, second best. Second <laughs> best. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna agree. Uh, Game of Thrones. I'm. Uh, I, I watched uh, every episode and most of the finale. Um, because <laughs> I. <laughs> you missed the finale. No, no, no. I watched most of the finale. Oh. At some wow. point, I was just like, "All right, I'm done." <laughs> That's real. I kind of felt like that. Yeah, I was like, please don't end like this. Please don't end like this. Yeah. I was trying to prolong it, and yeah. I mean, it's... honestly, I probably have like five or ten minutes left. Like, I literally saw like almost the entire thing. So, but um, yeah, that finale, man, I, I wasn't here for that. Uh, Brianna, what about you? I've never read Harry Potter. Okay. I've seen the first three movies and the last half of the sixth book, which was the last movie, which is more than I've seen of Game of Thrones. So I have to go with Harry Potter just because I've seen okay. more of it. Yeah, I've only seen the first four movies, but I own them all. I just never got a chance to catch up. And now is probably a good time to do so. But I, I do remember that third movie. I quite enjoyed um, a bit. Uh, the Prisoner of Azkaban. Yeah, you quite enjoyed a bit. That's not even yeah. possible. You either quite uh, enjoy it or you enjoy it a bit. You can't. Uh, yes. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. This one uh, back to you, Aiden. Invisibility or super speed? Uh, is it just me that's super fast, or can I like read and like function super fast as well? Probably. Yeah. Probably the yeah. latter. I think you can function like. It's probably like uh, invisibility versus being Flash, I guess. Yeah, yeah, I guess I'll, I'll do Flash. I mean, that, yeah. yeah, super speed. Speed. Yeah. What about you, Cleo? Um, probably speed. Okay. Uh, invisibility. Um, guess any time I really want to be invisible. So. You know, I guess if you're super fast nobody will ever see you too right yeah, so that's it that's a, you know, like it could yeah. be the same thing <laughs> they could be um i'm gonna go with speed too because johnny brought up like you know when you're moving so fast everything else is moving slowly so you can probably do a ton of stuff you know for being so fast get things done and then you'll have like more time to do other things so okay. i'm gonna go with speed what about you brianna um, I'm going to cha change my answer over last time because I just realized that super speed involves running, which I am <laughs> diametrically opposed to doing, and I am invisible, so I'll just stay invisible. Uh, okay. I mean, sure. Yeah. Plus, uh, anything anything that involves running is completely off the table, right off the bat. I'm not uh -oh. a fan of running either. You get your taxes done really quick. You're just sitting there on the computer and just... Uh -oh. Yeah. There you go. That would be yeah. nice. Uh, the, the, the one day a year. Yeah, that's very helpful. <laughs> <laughs> uh, next one. All right, Aiden, back to you. Uh, back on the Game of Thrones topic here. Jon Snow or Sam Tarly? However you want to take it. Great crap. Maybe who would you rather I be? I don't think I got to Sam Tarly. That's the big guy, right? Yeah, that goes to the Citadel. Cit 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 what, what is it? What is it called? I don't know. Um, I haven't seen him in action, so Jon Snow. Okay. He did take on some White Walkers. Uh, mm -hmm. Sam Tarly. Uh, what about you, Khalil? I don't know if you... Do you well, you, yeah, you've seen it. Mm -hmm. Jon Snow or Sam Tarly? Definitely going with Jon Snow. Okay. 
Jon Snow, he felt, yeah. Leader type of guy, you know what I'm saying? Okay, even if he knows nothing? Really, really, really knows. But he be knowing what he want to do, though. Okay. You know what I'm saying? He be knowing what he want to do, and he make it happen. So, definitely go with Jon Snow. Okay. Um, yeah, why not? I'm on the Jon Snow boat. The only thing with him is, like, he's short. Jon Snow's a short guy. But, you know, he does not know how to fight. I'm t- I'm taller than Jon Snow. Okay. Yeah, I'm probably. Yeah. Peter, how tall are you? Uh, five seven. I didn't want to say that, but yeah, I'm five seven. <laughs> my bad, bro. <laughs> no, it's cool. My my son's like six foot. Yeah, yeah. My yeah, same. Peter's yesterday. the same height I am. Yeah. Um. Five seven. <laughs> my sister's five eight. Yeah, I think um, Kit Harrington, who plays Jon Snow, I believe he's like five three, five four. So he's a he's a short guy. I mean, everybody on that show is short. Oh, I bet. Yeah, you're probably right, except for the mountain, right? I'm probably a giant on that show. Yeah, I would probably say so. How tall are you, Cleo? Six one. Six one. Okay. Um, I feel like well, this and might Brienne have come up. is like six two, six three. Brienne of Tarth is that her name? Yeah, it is. Isn't she taller than that? I like. I feel Brienne of Tarth might be taller yeah she's like super tall yeah um I mean, all the short people around her probably make her look even taller that's true that's a good point that's a good point uh i feel like we we asked somebody this but Khalil, are you taller than gianni i don't know if it was with you or what but that's come gianni up. be growing out of nowhere bro he be, he be mid-season and he be taller than when i met him <laughs> when i when i last saw him it, it, yeah don't answer this at all Khalil. like like put your head down and like cover your face just in case your face gives away stuff. It was you and me talking, Peter, and it was about all the people that think that that's Chris walking out ahead of Robbie in the juvenile hall in the trailer. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I did remember it being recent. Yeah, and um, we were. I was saying that you were taller than Gianni in that scene that you had together, where you were standing in the backyard. You were taller than him when that was filmed. Either that, or you were standing uphill from him. Yeah, but. So you guys, uh, yeah, but yeah, season two, season two, I was taller than Gianni. Okay. Um, I don't think no. I, I mean, this shouldn't be spoiler, but did you guys notice if Owen got much taller too when you guys saw him from the first time to the second time? Kind they all like they grown up because we haven't seen we ain't seen each other for like eight nine months. Yeah. So everybody looked a little older, even myself. Yeah. I was looking That's at my cool. like my pictures from last year. You guys are all turning from babies into men. You need to stop right now. <laughs> and it's nice seeing like yeah. everybody getting in shape too. You know, not to say that you guys weren't in shape, but like everyone's. You you can tell that you guys been working out from all the karate. Right. So. I'm sitting over <laughs> here as a mom though, going, "Stop growing up. Just stop right where you are." And yeah, <laughs> there you go, Flex. Yeah. Hey, hey Clue, can you point me to the direction where Chicago is? <laughs> I'm supposed to do like. Pretty sure. <laughs> that, <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Look at that. All right. Okay, we got a few more here. Um, uh, my answer is Sam Tarley because that's the one that Dimitri is. Ah, uh, yes. I apologize. Sorry. Tangent. Derek threw me off. I thought we were done with that one. No, that's fine. That was a good, that was okay. a good tangent, though. Now, here's a good one. Now that the both of you are here, this kind of goes back to... Um, uh, Related to something we've already asked, but ass face or douchebag? Aiden, you first. I like ass face. I like ass face. It's more of a compliment, assuming that someone might be sitting on my face. So there you go. Ass face. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> and we are suddenly not Aiden. safe for work. <laughs> I don't know how we come back from that. <laughs> Well, he answered my question, which is, why was Mitch so insistent on being ass face? Douchebag is definitely a less insult. It's but, like, oh my goodness. Okay. <laughs> I, I don't think oh, there's no anywhere problem. you can go from that. We're, we're just done. We can, we can shut the stream off now. We're done. Buddy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. See you next time. Oh boy, uh, Khalil, I'm scared of your answer, but uh, <laughs> uh douche breath. What does that mean? <laughs> uh, 
Oh, boy. Yeah, I, I, I would definitely not rather be Deuce Breath, because that's like stinky breath. Right, right. Oh, boy. Um, the other day. Okay. Yikes. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, I, I like what some of the people are saying here in the chat. That's funny. Yeah, um, we're, we're rated TVMA now. We're no longer safe yeah. work. We are, yeah. We've lost control. It, it just, we're R-rated now. Yeah, I think uh, when I answered this the first time, I went with ass face because, like, douchebag is kind of, you know, you call somebody a douchebag because they're mean, at least ass face. There's a little creativity to that. <laughs> yeah. That's what I'm going with. <laughs> Yara, and, what about you? And, and I said, I said douchebag because all that the, the the most that douchebag means is you're useless. Okay. Ass face means literally your ass and your face <laughs> look the same. Yeah. But I feel like yes. douchebag uh-huh. like you could be like a sorry very sarcastic bit person and somebody be like yeah you're a douchebag. Okay. Yeah. Right. That tracks. And Daniel's a raging douchebag, so I've got to go with douchebag. Yeah. I mean it. Yeah. Just it's a thing. I mean, it takes a special someone to be an ass face. So I'm going to stick with ass face on that one. <laughs> All right. Uh, the next one we got here. Uh, Allie with an I or Tori with a Y. So however you want to take that, whether it's the, the characters or the names. Uh, Allie with an I. Okay. That's how my sister spells it. So, yeah. Uh, uh, so, okay. Yeah, my sister's Allie. Oh. Allie. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, that's sweet. Uh, what about you, Khalil? I don't know anybody named Allie, to be honest with you. <laughs> Did you you see the first Karate Kid, haven't you? Yeah, yeah. I'm talking oh, about. Okay. I'm talking about like personally. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That that's that name. Allie, but... So that's good then. That that uh, kind of makes it a little bit more difficult. So. So, but if I had a kid and I had to name them Allie, I would probably spell spell it A L L I E. Okay. So, Ali, for you, um, I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna go with Ali with an I. She's the OG, you know. Um, but but we already got her though. I always talk about how, you know, we want more Tory. We want more backstory. Uh, right now, everyone. Even though John Hurwitz and Stacey Harmon has come out and said it's Tori Nichols, people are like, well, she still could be Allie's daughter. Yes. Um, so I just, you know, what? I'm going to change it back to Tori because I want more stories. So that way we can get all these naysayers to be like, oh, OK, maybe she's not related, to, you know, to to Allie. Uh, maybe she's related to Terry. Uh, what about you, Brianna? Oh, shut up with the Terry thing. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to have to go with Dylan in the chat there, which is Daniel with an L. No, um, I, no I, I'm, I'm going to go. They're both badass women. They both know exactly what they want. They both know how to get it and screw anybody who does not like that. But Allie is sane. So I'm going to have to go with Allie. Okay. All right. Tori Sounds is good. slightly not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I like your answer still. <laughs> um, we already asked that one. Okay, here's a good one. Uh, this is about, yes. You were about to say something? Oh, I, I, I was laughing. Alejandro said low battery with a B. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's pretty good. All right. Uh, so this is this is going to be about Hawk. Uh, so Aiden, to you, season one Hawk or season two Hawk? Mm. I think I think the red, like the whole red get up is like a lot more like, like he's, he gets like a lot more like aggressive and like just yeah, like in the third, yeah. second, third season. So. Yeah, pro- probably. Yeah, probably second season Hawk. Okay. All right. What about you, Khalil? Definitely going with. Um, I think first season Hawk. That's kind of like when he, you know, what I'm saying, understood he didn't want to be no nerd no more. Uh-huh. Um, but he really, you feel me, developed into a, into a real hood. Huh. <laughs> you know, what I'm saying the second season. Yeah. He died in red, so I'm, I'm gonna go with second season Hawk. So you, so you guys like uh, um, him more aggressive in the season two then? Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah. Because season one, um, you know what? I really, really like the character of um, Eli. Uh, I really like that storyline, how he was bullied and I like the transformation. Uh, so I, I like a, a bit of an origin story. So I'm going to go with season one, Hawk. What about you, Brianna? 
season one hawk because there is still so much of my precious, precious baby boy Eli in him. And okay. by season two, there's very little hope of my baby boy Eli ever coming back. <laughs> okay. All right. I like this next pairing here. This one is from Chiara, one of our moderators from Italy. Uh, fish sticks or sashimi? Or shishimi, depending how you pronounce it. I like sashimi. I really like okay. s- salmon sashimi a lot. That's my okay. Favorite. It's pretty good, too. Do you also like the seared seared salmon? Uh, I don't think I've had... Like, what's the difference? Uh, seared salmon, they just take the flame and... Oh, seared, you know, seared salmon. Seared. Oh. Yeah, yeah, that's good, too. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. What about you, Khalil? Fish sticks. Fish sticks are dope. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, yeah, I, I like me some sushi. I just had some for lunch yesterday, actually, during work. But uh, I'll go with the uh, shishimi. Uh, Brianna, uh, fish sticks are dope for you? I actually almost broke down and bought sashimi the last time we got Chinese, but I ended up getting shrimp and garlic sauce instead. So I got to stay with fish sticks because I'm still afraid of sushi. You almost, I mean, you were almost there. I was almost so there. You... I thought about it. I thought yeah. about it. <laughs> maybe one day you'll try it. I might. I'm holding out for you. Okay. All right. This one's a good one. Um, this one is going to be interesting because it is uh, rival dojos, and you guys are also rival rival dojos. Uh, but Bert or Nathaniel to Aiden. Uh, and then also, um, Owen might be in the group. <laughs> Bert. I mean, no, I mean, I mean, don't have to be no, I must. Damn it. All right. <laughs> Take two. I was trying to spite you, and I ended up voting for you. We'll fix what it a- in post. We'll fix it in post. It'll be good. Thank you. <laughs> I, just, I, just, I just like the potty mouth on, on Nate. Yeah, it's funny. Oh, okay. Just, just seeing seeing all that come out of a little kid. It's like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's funny. Yeah, yeah. And and Nate is uh, younger than Owen, so um, and I didn't realize that. Gosh, what are they? Two years apart. Oh, See, yeah. yeah. When I first saw season two, I thought. I mean, the characters are supposed to be the same age, but I didn't realize that. Yeah, that Owen and, and Nate are actually two years yeah, apart. Yeah, Owen's so. like in high school, I think. Yeah. Yeah, he, Owen just he, got his driver's license. Uh, but Nate That's just important. finished up eighth grade, didn't he? <laughs> So Wait, a driver's race. license or driver's permit? He'll have to tell us in the chat. Well, I know he passed the test. I didn't even attempt. So, <laughs> yeah. Uh, what, me what did Owen just say? He said, "Make the right choice." Oh, <laughs> make the right choice. I uh, I thought he was giving some insight. Um, uh, Cleo, what about you? Bert or Nathaniel? I gotta go. It's hard. I like both of them. But yeah, Nate, Nate does say like some potty mouth things. <laughs> okay. And I, and, uh, and I enjoy when he says those things. I think it's funny. So. Okay. Uh, be- so I think I'm going to go with Nate. Before but I also, answer. But also, Owen's funny also. He is. Yeah, yeah. And, you know, John keeps teasing uh, something about Bert in season three, and we'll leave it at that. But we don't know anything. We just know that something happens with Bert in season three that's going to make uh, the fans love him even more or something. So we're looking forward to that. Uh, before I pick one, um, uh, Aiden, your your mom heard that one remark uh, when we all about fell off our chair. <laughs> Just, she wanted me to let you know that. <laughs> oh no! Which which one? There is a few parts that that I'm worried about. I think I, I think we're <laughs> talking about the ass face douchebag. <laughs> <laughs> Not the bong and skinny dipping. No. Uh, <laughs> no no I, no concerns there. It might be about the other thing. <laughs> There are some um, things you don't tell mom. That just or, yeah. Drinking the beers before twenty. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so you guys both said Nathaniel, right? Yeah. Aiden said yeah. Nathaniel. I don't. Did Khalil? Right. Did you? Did you settle on one? I I said, say, I say I like said Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go with. Uh, now Owen knows I love me some Bert. Uh, I I do want to see um, Nathaniel just because he came. He was a new character in season two, so I can use more of him. Um, so I and I know we're gonna get both of them, obviously. But if I had to pick just a one, I'd like to see more of Nathaniel. But I I, I want to see 
a Burt and Nathaniel dance off too. Sorry, AJ, I know you're in the group also, but um, I just want to see those two go at it some more. Uh, what about you, Brianna? I got to take up for my boy Burt. Nobody's picking Burt. I, I, I love them both. They're adorable. You can't pander to the group here. But, no, I'm not. Um, <laughs> but, I mean, I've been one of the people saying that, you know, Burt is the true star of the show since halfway through season one. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, Burt. Okay. All Actually, right. I my answer. Okay. I choose the thing's brother, his little brother. <laughs> uh benji yes benji i think he uh-huh. needs to make he needs to make an appearance on the show okay there you go i can get down with that is that the baby yeah oh he's so cute yes he's the cutest baby i've ever held in my life oh that's sweet um i think he just had a birthday i feel he's probably, he's probably like three now yeah yeah um that's a sweet answer so we'll we'll pass that on to nate um all right, uh, we'll maybe do one more and then throw out some of those uh, trivia questions we were talking about earlier off mic. So um, how about, okay, this one will be interesting. Um, you guys at least seen the first two movies, Credit Kid 1 and 2? Yep. And Okay, what about 3? The third Credit Kid movie too? <laughs> Khalil, how about you? Yeah? yeah okay, so uh, Mike Barnes. Who's the villain in part three or chosen the villain in part two? Mike Barnes, because he had more of a reason to be like a psychopath. Like he <laughs> just was like, I need the money, sign it. <laughs> the other guy's just like, hey, screw you. And just like wants to like fight him for no reason. Like, I don't know. <laughs> okay. I can see that. Uh, yeah. What, you, what about you, Khalil? I like Chosen. You like Chosen? Okay. Yeah, yeah, he's. I think I've told you this before, but yeah, I like him the best. He's, it may have come up during one of those live things that we did. He's very, um, he's very badass. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna go with Chosen on this just because um, he's the one that I watched the most growing up as a kid. So, um, but you know, both both actors are, you know, very. Um, they're awesome. They're badasses in their own right. So. Uh, what about you, Brianna? Um, going to have to go with Chosen. It's my favorite of the three movies. It's my favorite movie ever. Um, he was legitimately a bad guy, and Mike was just a piece of crap doing it for money. So, got to go with Chosen. Okay. So, um, this that that's going to be the end of the this or that. So, that's just kind of tune in and see what you guys think. Uh, I wonder if there's any surprises for those that tuned in. So, we do want to do a bit of a trivia competition to see who uh, knows their cast members a little bit better. So, either we'll do the best of five or the first to three. Uh, Brianna, I um, already kind of gave you some examples. If you want to, we'll alternate asking a question. And, um, and Khalil and Aiden... Whoever has the answer first, first person to raise their hand will call on you first. I think you should start because I haven't thought of one yet. Okay. All right. Um, let's see here. Uh, two fellow castmates of yours was in a movie called The Swap. Who are they? Uh, Khalil. Mm, Jacob and Payton. You got it. Khalil's got one. Yay. Have you guys seen those movie? Uh, that movie? I haven't. No, neither. Okay. I knew that. I knew that they did work a lot together. So I was like, I'm pretty sure it's some. It's gonna be embarrassing if I'm wrong. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. I mean, I'm really confident. Just that one. <laughs> yeah. You know, being put on the spot. You guys work with a lot of different people, and so yeah, I, I can't imagine this being uh, too easy. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So my turn. Um. Which cast member was on a season of Dancing with the Stars? <laughs> Not even a guess? Uh, okay, Aiden. Aiden? Is it- Martin Cove. <laughs> no. Khalil, yeah, that- do you have a, do you have a guess? Is it Ralph? Yay! It is Ralph. It is Ralph. <laughs> He was. He came in third place. Hey, I'm two and no game. You heard? Yeah. Me? I'm two and no. Catch up, bro. All right. All right. All right fine. <laughs> okay. All right. This no, one. Uh, 
Fourth place. This one might be tougher. Uh, we'll we'll find out. Uh, two cast members f- from season one. I'm going to word it that way. Two two actors from season one have been in um, TV shows that were based off of an older property. One was Parenthood. The other was Heather's. Who are those actors? Khalil? I know Solo played on... Um, I forgot, but it's about Parenthood. Right, mm-hmm. yep. Solo played on that one. What's the other one called? Heather's. Heather's. Was, yeah. What channel that came on? I don't know. Uh, it was... It was I don't know. I don't know the second one, then. Okay. Aiden? Jake? Uh, I want to say Jacob or Gianni. The show was called Heathers. Uh, that, that was based off of an 80s movie. Oh. I didn't know they ever did a show of Heathers. There's a Broadway play. Yeah. I didn't know there was a TV show of it. Uh, Mary? Okay. Not Mary. So, the um, Anna Lisa Cochran was in Heather's. I was going to say, it, it, it absolutely had to be her, and she had to be the first Heather that died. But, are you sure it wasn't the play? Uh, no, I'm positive. It was a show. But really? um, I don't I don't know who she played. I just know she was in Heather's. Because uh, we talked about it during the interview. This was like over two years ago. Two oh, and a half wow. years ago. But, um, yeah, because she was... Uh, we were talking about like maybe if I watched the show, then she would come back and talk about Heather's or something. So. Oh wow! Uh, yeah, she she absolutely like fits right in. Yeah. A- a- uh, into the, the that role, she looks exactly like the girl that played her in the first movie. So. Uh, Brian, you have another question. So right now, Khalil still has two and zero. Oh. Okay. Um. Which cast member? Two and a half. Two, two and a half. Look at a half <laughs> okay. a point. <laughs> um, which cast member was on NCIS? Aiden or uh, Khalil? No, Khalil. Yeah, Sorry. Yeah. Ralph. <laughs> Ralph. Not no. Ralph, right? Okay. Not Ralph. He did an episode of NCIS. Nope. Nope. Ralph's never been on it. He was on. Um, Law, he was on Law and Order, Criminal Intent. He was not on NCIS. Oh. Um, no, you have a guess? I was thinking about uh, Psych. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, he's on a lot of that. William? Zapka? No. Nope. No, no, not Billy. Mary was it, was Mauser. It, was it, was it, was it, oh, damn it. She played, she played Gibbs's daughter. Now it's Mary. Okay. <laughs> now it's Mary. Yep. Okay. I, I, I got one. Yeah, this Probably not. Like... <laughs> I think I think this would be a good one. It depends who raises the hands first. Uh, which two actors from Cobra Kai was also on Fuller House? <laughs> <laughs> I ain't never seen that show. I have no clue. I know one I th- of them. Shit. I gotta think of the other one. Was it Tanner? Tanner was one. Tanner dances. You guys should check that out. Tanner has a dance off. He's the king of a dance crew. Yeah. Now I want to see Robbie and AJ do a dance off. Matter of fact, they talked to AJ about Tanner's dancing one time. <laughs> J Cat's answer is Tanner and crap I don't know, which is that's that's mine too. Like who is the second person? All right, the second person was Courtney. Was on Fuller House? Really? Yep. Yep. Courtney was also on Fuller House. Huh. And it was at some point before I, I watched Cobra Kai, so I don't even know who she was, but I do know she was in it. Nice. Okay. Let me let me let me think about this real quick and make sure that I I'm gonna I gotta word this a very specific way. Which cast member was nominated for an Oscar but not in an acting category? Oh, okay. I don't know the answer. <laughs> Can we get a hint on what the category was? Was it uh, oh, best, best foreign language picture? 
Oh, foreign language picture? Was, it was like, I thought it was document. It's a... Okay. Well, it's foreign language something. Yeah. Yikes. <laughs> I feel terrible because I don't know none of this. I don't know. We're going <laughs> to have you when I get back to set. <laughs> Go ahead, Brianna. Like fake fr- fake fan. Okay, so you're both waving off. You both you both give up. Yeah. Uh, yes. uh, uh, Owen. Yeah. <laughs> Owen. Um, yeah, I know. But he never told us. Okay, <laughs> Amy is telling me that it was best short film. Okay. Yeah, it was, it was definitely a short film. It was like, was it 13 minutes or 23 minutes or so? Something short. But it was in Polish, wasn't it? Um. Polish or something. I think you're right. I think you're. I think you're right. It was Billy. Yeah, it was Billy. Damn. Yeah. All right. Here, here's one. Okay. Which cast member has worked with Mark Wahlberg? Aiden. Me. Yeah. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you were on Hangover. Yeah. No. <laughs> no, 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 Ted. 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 Oh, Ted. 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 That's me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Amy, Amy is Amy's correcting me all over the place. Billy's film was in Czech. Okay, I thought so because that's what he speaks. Yes, I just I I, I knew the non-acting part. So, all right, so it's my turn again. Um, let's see. Hmm. <laughs> I, I got one. If you want to. Want some time to think about it? Think yeah, of one. Yeah, you go. I'm, I'm thinking. All right. Which cast member was on Ant Farm? No, no come on. No, you're <laughs> you're oh, giving him to I, him. No, I have my hand up first. Okay, okay, Khalil raised Khalil his did. hand, so Khalil gets the answer. <laughs> Gonna go with Aiden Meeks. All right, there you go. Yay. First to three. <laughs> All right. I'll try to make it two and uh, like two and two. So. <laughs> <laughs> Aiden was too busy being incredulous to raise his hand, though. <laughs> I'm like, I was just like, is. I, I feel like he would have won anyway, <laughs> no matter what questions we were. Oh no, but yeah, I'm, I'm more of a competitor, more than a competitor. <laughs> right? Get that answer yeah. in. Hit that buzzer. That's right. All right, guys. Good job. Um, Khalil has bragging rights. Uh, he. Uh, won the the little pop quiz trivia game there at the very end. Um, That's me apparently. All right. <laughs> <laughs> so definitely want to thank you guys for uh, for coming on the show, uh, spending spending some time with us. Aiden, it's your birthday weekend, so congrats again and thanks yes. thanks for coming on. Happy birthday! Thank you, boys. Um, now, uh, obviously, season three aside, is there anything you guys are? I, I know there's there has been a whole lot of things going on this year, but is, do you guys have anything to promote, um, or e- even older stuff that you want to tell the listeners or viewers about that they can check out? Be happy. Well, don't 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 be mean and be good people. Love everyone. Love everyone. Yeah. Aww. You two are my okay. favorites now. Except for Miyagi Do's because they're trash. Hey. All right. Thank you. That's uh, not right. If, if we're being honest, Cobra Kai is Cobra Kai has lost every non tournament fight they've been in, and they only win those when they cheat. I mean, you know. <sighs> Riona, I was staying out of it. <laughs> <laughs> I had to get up out of there. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, um, Khalil, you were in the movie Beats. That's on Netflix. So uh, for anybody that wants to see more Khalil, check out Beats. Um, that's definitely there. Um, Aiden, I don't. I, I know I watched Ted one day, and I sent a, a, a screenshot to your mom that I was like, "Hey, look at Aiden," you know. Um, so I don't know if that's on there, but you were, uh, yeah, in Ted Giovanni Ribisi's son, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that one. So, if anybody uh, has access to that, check out Aiden and Ted because you probably forgot that was him. So, because yeah, that was a surprise to me when I was doing that bit of research. Yeah. So, uh, uh, now do you guys want to throw out your socials or socials? Yeah, your social medias uh, real quick uh, for those. Oh, just in case. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, I I, I got to charge you guys for this. Uh, you know, guest spot. <laughs> no, uh, just where people can find you if you, if they don't already follow you. 
you, you can find me on Instagram at Khalil Everett. That's K H A L I L E V E R A G E. And yeah, you can just search that and you can find the stuff from there. Yep. Sometimes you guys will find me on the live with him too. Mm-hmm. <laughs> when he's bored. Mm-hmm. Uh, what about you, Aiden? Uh, my Instagram is uh, Aiden Minx, but good luck spelling it. Um, yeah, <laughs> E D I N. Is it backwards? No, no, no it's right. Yeah, it's, it's good. good. Okay. It goes up backwards on mine. A E D I N M A N C K S. So, you know, good time. Happy time. It's great. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So, I Brianna, you. On any coffee mugs. I no. like that. <laughs> uh, Brianna, you got anything to, to promote? No. Okay. All right. It looks like Owen's taking off in the chat room. Bye, Owen. Um, um, Hi. Uh, oh, AJ oh, said he Camille misses Benji. you. Aww. That's cute. He's so cute. Uh, so we're looking at a picture of Nate's Nate's little brother, for those that are wondering. Um, why don't you post some of these? That's me giving him watermelon. Yeah. <laughs> and then him, then he, him running after I gave him watermelon, as if he stole the watermelon from me. Hey, Aiden, you got any photos? Oh, Hannah is actually in the chat. She just said hello. Oh, look at that. You. Yeah, Hannah. As, you're, as you're, you're showing her son off. <laughs> <laughs> Benji says hi. Hey, Benji. What's the word, bro? I haven't talked in a long time. Yeah, Khalil really changed there when he's talking about Benji. He's a bit of a glow. <laughs> That's my boy. Yeah, you missed that boy. All um, right. Um... What do I have to promote? Uh, Brianna, at some point, I, I, I imagine uh, you and I. What was that? Oh. We're sexy ninjas. Wait, who is that behind you? Aiden. Is that Aiden? Yeah. <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> when was that taken? Season one. <laughs> two? Well, season two. Their first oh, yeah, season. season two. Yeah, season Our two. First, oh, okay. yeah. Our first season. I got you. Let's get that I mess. like that photo. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. <laughs> I got a lot of pictures. I used to take pictures of right. everything else. Up. You got, you got. We got to see some of those. We got to post some of those for None us. None of the season three stuff though. That'll get right. you and us in trouble. Yes, oh, yeah, that's yeah. right. Season All two, right. yeah, the season two stuff that you haven't posted. And it's like, but I and you forget to take a picture, like at, like at all. But <laughs> but yeah. Um, let me see. Uh, promoting, yeah, Brianna, you and I will probably go over some of John Hurwitz's Q and A's. He he's done two like in the past week or so. Right, we've got four hours worth of Q and A to record now. Yeah. Um, also, we have our banquets, which I need to wrap up the categories for voting for anybody that's following us on Instagram, Twitter, all over social media. We've been um, releasing some of these uh, videos with like categories and they're kind of like the Academy Awards. And you can nominate. Uh, you can go to our web page, right, our Facebook page right now. It has all the different uh, links where you can go and vote for those categories. Some were like be- uh, best badass moments, uh, best all value fight scenes, um, you know, things like that. So check it out, vote. And once we put up the last bit of categories, we'll probably do like a live awards show, maybe have a special guest host to help read the winners, you know, so that'll be fun. Um, I think, I think that's it. Uh, just make sure you guys follow us on social media and we'll put out all the latest details of anything we're doing. So Khalil Aiden, would you guys stand by while we wrap up? I want to thank everyone for tuning in live And we'll catch you guys next time. Bye, everybody.